All right, are we doing good morning from Naga City here in the Bicol region of the Philippines? Now, if you don't know, Bicol is at the southern end of Luzon and it's known for volcanoes and spicy food, so we're super excited to be here. It should be really good. Right now, we're heading down to Naga City Centre, to the town centre, to see what's going on. I mean, look at the streets, though. Big difference than Manila, in it? It's so peaceful, it's tropical. Look at the feel around here. It's so nice, you have got all the kids here going mental. So let's go and do it. Wow! Yeah. Oh, I used to do my giraffe. Such wow! Yeah. Baru the baton. I wait. Hello. Oh wow! Very good. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Look at that. What is your dog called? What is her name? Happy. 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 Oh, <laughs> beautiful, beautiful. So you've been practicing. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> Very good. Are you staying in Naga for yeah. how long? Five days. Ah. Oh. Yeah, so. Are you going from England? England. Oh my God. <laughs> England, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you like the accent of England? Yeah. Oh, you like, you like. Yeah. Oh, sorry, sorry. It's always watching Happy Bee. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Okay. Okay. Have a nice day. Okay, nice to meet you. you. Goodbye. Take care. Take care. <laughs> Enjoy staying in Naga. Oh, thanks so much. So first impressions, like literally just walking down these local streets here in Naga is everyone's lovely, everyone has time for you like it's a different world than Manila like I said, I mean this is still a city, I'm guessing the centre will be busier but everyone has time for a chat, everyone's really lovely like chilled out, that's what I'm getting to, chilled out and smiley, everyone's lovely. Right we have just stopped at this little hole in the wall, little eatery spot for some breakfast, it's called Eat Chakan. We're waiting for the food now, but look how peaceful it is here in Naga. I'm loving it. Like, look at the street. We're just on a little back street here. Got a little trikes going past. There's a nice jeepney down there. Just got speaking to a lovely lady who was recommending us all kinds of things to do in Bicol, Naga, this whole region. Good morning. Good morning. And yeah, everyone has time for you here. I love it. So we'll just wait for the food now. <laughs> right, the food's coming. It looks well good. So I've got nasi goreng they call it, which is just like fried rice with chili in. We've got this chili oil, which is really good. And then I've got spam silog. So I've got two pieces of just absolute classic spam. Cucumber, tomato, the fried egg, to that. That's what we want. And leash, it's got something that looks really good. So I've got homemade corn beef, corn beef hash. So this is corn silog? Yeah, corn silog. That looks good. Looks so good. And then obviously that. Pile of rice, bit of garlic on the top. You're gonna have to try that homemade corned beef. I'm just gonna move because I'm next to the aircon, I don't wanna get aircon drip. <laughs> yeah, in the Philippines, like, well, in Manila anyway, everywhere you went, everywhere you walked, you'd have aircon dripping on you. And yeah, that's just black in the Philippines. Look, it's like actual beef, like shredded beef. It looked well though. Mm. That's good. I'm gonna have to pinch a bit of that. Yeah, I'll try. That was well good, doesn't it? Oh, it's garlic rice. Mm. Like actual garlic rice. Proper garlic rice? Yeah. Mm. This is really good. This is just like just a classic breakfast lap. These sea log places are all over the Philippines and it's just classic, it fills you up. Thank you so much. Oh, wow. ah, what is inside? Oh, is this this is pork? Uh, oh yeah, it's pork. Pork show mine. Yes. Okay, thank you, you so much. Yeah, of course, we eat everything, we eat everything. <laughs> thank you so much. Thank you. Oh, wow. How kind is that? Let's try these well, they're fresh. So this place also apparently does sell really good shumai. The lady we were just chatting to told us, you need to try the shumai. Oh, man. It's giving us some for free. That's so nice. They get the calamansi on there. Oh, yeah, these look good. They've got crispy garlic, like fried garlic on them as well. Let's give them a dip. <laughs> That's so nice, isn't it? Very good first impressions in Naga. Mm. Delicious. Very good though. Oh, Porky sides really good. Mm. Nice soft wrapper. Mm. They're not bad. They are really good. Mm. They're really good actually. Delicious. Mm. Oh, is so good on them. Right, so we'll just try the fried rice. And it looks like we've got some like sweet pork in there as well, look at that. So I it's very spicy, we'll see if it is spicy. Oh, it's got bits of meat in as well, yeah. 
little bits of meat. And yeah, it's perfect that. It's actually got quite a big kick to it. It doesn't look like it, but yeah, they've done that just right, yeah. It's got a really nice kick to it. And then we've got the Spam. This classic Spam. There she is. And a nice runny egg. You can't go wrong with this breakfast, I've just forgot. We've also got the um, this beautiful chilli oil, which we'll try on some rice. Mm, that's good. That's good, sweet, but also, yeah, very spicy. Love it. Really good breakfast. I'm happy. I'm happy here. <laughs> <laughs> With escape Manila. Yeah, it's so nice to like be away from like, especially when you go somewhere, you, your first impression is generally of that place. And we're not really sissy people. I don't know, it's sissy, but it seems a lot more chilled out than Manila. So I'm really liking it so far. Right, everything there just cost us 270 pesos with drinks. Not bad at all, really full. I'm actually full, there's so much rice there. So what we're doing now is head back out on the sunny Naga streets to the city centre wherever that may be, let's go. And let's see what Naga City is all about. First taste of Bicol. Oh, bit of a muddy patch here. When the sun's out, it does really feel tropical. We're going over the railway here and you can actually see down here that there's loads of people living on the railways, like all the way down. Like family, just living on the train tracks. Interesting little place. You see that in all different countries. All right, let's go. Here we are then crossing over the bridge into like the city center of Naga. Over this river, which is actually quite nice. You know, there's not that much litter in it. So I'm impressed with that. And then, if I can, yeah, I'll cross over and show you the other side. Hey, how's it going? Very good, you? As you can see, even the people in Naga are, um, very vocal. Yeah, it's nice on this side as well. So here we go, we're heading to the Naga Cathedral, which you can see there, it's huge. And it should be really beautiful. I mean, it looks it from here, so. So we've made it to Naga Cathedral, but before we go in, I'm just gonna show you this. Here we've got the sign, which is telling us when the masses are in the church, in what languages. And it's really interesting because here in Bicol, they speak their own language, Bicol. Yeah, so not just Tagalog, like everywhere in the Philippines has different dialects and languages. Like in the Visayas, they speak a different language as well. So it's really cool. So yeah, there we go, really nice. Hand painted sign, it's all heading. Right, it looks really beautiful, it's so big. So we'll go around the front where we can get a look, eh? Right, so Naga City is actually a pilgrim city here in the Philippines. And here we go, Naga Cathedral. Now, this church is absolutely huge, look at this. It's really beautiful. Look at the colour, it's like black really nice and then just outside we've got this like garden area with some trees I think there's loads of like students and people doing all kinds of stuff in here we'll take a walk through like doing some dancing and stuff and then we've got this I don't know what to call this see I call this a zocalo from spending so much time in Latin America it's shut I think but yeah it's really nice here it's peaceful yeah and this is like the first church you've been to in the Philippines so far that's peaceful and we can just relax in like and, and like breathe and listen. It's really nice, like there's no traffic around the church. But look at that, Naga City Cathedral. So I think people come to visit this from all over. Yeah, they call Naga City the Queen City of Bicol, the heart of Bicol, whatever, I don't know. Ah, so we've got a huge gate here, which we'll try and take a look at from over there where we can see it properly. But for now, our mate is coming over with the ice cream, so we'll see what he's got. How much is a cone? 
20 pesos lang. Can I have one, please? What's it got? Mango and cheese. Mango and cheese? Yeah. Ah. Is it good? Masaram. Masaram. <laughs> you make it at home? You make it? Yeah. Oh, this is cheese. Cheese is uh, mango. Oh. Mango and cheese ice cream, eh? How about that? 20 pesos a corn? This is what we need because honestly, I don't know if you can tell, it's so hot. I've left my towel at home, so. It's hot. Look at where we are, it's so beautiful. Honestly, this is like amazing. Salamat po. Thank you. Is it good? Oh, yeah. Oh. That's weird though. Yeah. Really nice fruity mango, then like a. That strange mm. cheesy taste, it's like creamy taste. Mm. I like it. It's good though. Yeah, how, it it. how beautiful it is. Yeah. yeah. I really like it, you know, I really like it. And we've got these <laughs> shaded pockets, we've got like trees everywhere and stuff. It's really nice. Hello, hello. We can hide in here and eat our ice cream. And there's a massive breeze as well, it's well good. Yeah, so we'll carry on walking around town. Just need to show you this gate from here because it is really nice and then if we cross over i mean i don't know if we're going to be able to do this because of the traffic but you can see the church through the through the gate yeah am i going to get a chance because there's a lot of traffic kicking around a lot of tricycles so many tricycles <laughs> we'll try and cross now give you like a two second glimpse there of the view all right good afternoon yeah, there you are. we'll carry on we'll carry on look how nice it is here well nice, the streets are well nice, really nice to walk around, really enjoying it. Look at this, the shade. Feels tropical like I said. Feels like I'm in Mexico, Latin America. Right then, we just spotted a man over there selling pineapples, so we're gonna go and try and take a look. Honestly, you really gotta be careful not to get run over, but there's food everywhere, like we've got local food spots like this one. Selling all kinds of local food. Hello, how's it going? Ah. We, we will come back. It looks good. Yeah, we will come back. Okay. We'll come back. You Thank you. Every day. Twenty-four hours. Twenty-four hours. Wow. Okay. Ah, and you sell you sell local bicol foods. Bicol, yes, we have this one. Ah, bicol express. Bicol express. Yeah. Ah, okay. And laing pinoy. Shark, 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 did you shark? Oh. Yeah. 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 You sell spicy, spicy food, yeah? Yeah. Yeah. Is that Hito? We'll come back, we'll come back. Okay, okay. Thank, Thank you, you. Thank you. So much. We are here for five days. Okay. We'll come back. Thank you. Have a good day. So they got all kinds of local vehicle specialties. We'll come back for them, actually. Right. Hello, hello. What's up, bro? It's all made, it's got these tiny pineapples here. How are you? Hello. We have pineapples, piña. Piña. Yeah. They're, they're tiny. They're tiny. Yeah. Like so a small. grenade. Like a grenade. Yeah. Where, where are they from? Picol. From Dayan. Oh, from Dayan, Norte. Oh. Look oh. oh. at the size of these um, pineapples. Let's get one, yeah. Yeah, let's get a little bag of 25. That's right. Let me just hold this up. From what country, madam? Yeah. Look at the size of that compared to Alicia's head. Yeah. We've never seen pineapples this small. Yeah, never no. seen. A tiny. Twenty-five. Twenty-five pesos. But they yeah. are very sweet because they are so small. Yeah. Yeah. Twenty. Right. Twenty-five pesos. Thank you very much. Okay. Thank, Thank you. you. Salamat po. Thank you. Have a good day. Together. Yeah. Let's find someone to try this little baby pineapple. Then. So Do we need a little stick? No, I think you just bite them. Bite them. Yeah. yeah. Right, here's our baby pineapples. Look, They're like hand size. <laughs> we get two for 25 pesos. Not bad at all. They smell fantastic. They smell really sweet. Wow. Oh, messy. Dripping everywhere, but that's really good, that. That's juicy, yeah. Mmm. Oh, that's good. That's good pineapple. Messy though. It's like an apple. <laughs> mm. apple that's really good, that. Mm. 
Oh, look how small they are. That's a proper little snack like for a sunny day like this. That is, that is phenomenal. How about this one? Naga City, turning boys to men. You can get the circumcision package. Your journey to becoming a man starts here in Naga City. That's funny. So down here, I think there's some sort of party going on. Can you hear the karaoke? So we're going to investigate. Everyone. And I mean, everyone is really nice. Even the people working in the hospital are really nice. Everyone we've come across has been really pleasant. What was she saying? Oh wow. I said he needs to become a man. <laughs> <laughs> so. Excellent fact for you. Most people in Naga are circumcised. How about that? <laughs> Just what you wanted to hear, innit? That's why we all tuned into this video. And here we've got another beautiful church here in Naga City. And then around the corner we have got Plaza Rizal. Somewhere around here. I think this is around about actually, but it's somewhere. So we'll go and try and find it. I think we are in like the center of Naga City now. I mean, yeah, we must be because the roads are big. You know, there's more traffic. And it's all going on. We've got the chains, so we've got like McDonald's, Jollibee's, Chow King, all that rubbish. But the church is nice. I mean, you've got to love the public transport here though, because it's always so colorful. I really love it because it's always hand painted. You can't go wrong. Right, we'll carry on. Yeah, check this place out. It's kind of just like a roundabout, like kind of like a roundabout, but it's really nice. Big trees. Or there's some sort of memorial. But it's really nice because it's just somewhere to sit and relax in the shade. Yeah, this is definitely like the center of Naga City for sure. Like there's a lot more going on, but even then it's manageable. It's not like Manila or something like that. It's still fairly chilled out. Before we show you the little plaza, we're just going to grab a drink because they've got all these little shops selling drinks. What Magic what, water. What flavor is it? Huh? I can taste, okay. I will guess, yeah? <laughs> <laughs> Buy it and guess. Is this the same Magic water we had in Manila? I think that's why it is, like banana, but it said no. They put like a little scented um, thing in it, don't they? I don't know. And then they've got blue lemonade, cucumber. Cucumber, eh? My arch nemesis, but it seems to be popular, so it must be all right. Which one? Right? I just eat them, you have quite quick. Yeah, wow, that's a big quick. Oh, that's a massive. Massive. We have just eaten, sorry, we are full. We are full. We've just, we've just eaten, so we are full. You can take them. You can take them? Oh, to take away for take away. Ah, Tussler, you're a salesman. What should I get? I might get a. Which one are you getting? I've got magic water. I'll get a blue lemonade, yeah. yeah. Please can we get one blue lemonade? One magic water, one blue lemonade. How much are they? Ten. Ten pesos each. Oh, I'm going to steal your magic water. Ah, it's cold. Mm -hmm. It's the same one we have. What do you think it tastes like? I don't know, it's like, it's sweet. I don't yeah. know, I can't explain the taste. Like banana and bubblegum. Like banana and bubblegum. Uh, Jackfruit. Gulaman. Is that with the... Is that, is that the grass, grass jelly? Gulaman. Is it similar? Similar. Oh, it's similar. It's got little bits of jelly in. Yeah, yeah. I think it tastes like, yeah, like bubblegum, banana, jackfruit, like a strange, strange combo. Ooh, that's good. Thank you. Is this what we want, the blue lemonade? That's what you want. Are you a blood, Yeah, yeah, yeah. This is good. You, YouTube. Yeah, YouTube. Go on. How much? How much is a cup of quick quick? Twenty. Twenty. Twenty or twenty-two. Which is the smallest one? I'll take. I'll take a small one. Twenty. Twenty. What does that win? We call this here bula stop. We call this in Naga bula stop. Bula stop. Ah. What is it inside? Is it an egg? Ah, yeah. and this is 20? 20? 20. Oh, I'll have one then, go on, I'll take one here. Yeah. I'll take one. That blue lemonade's cracked. Go on, let's try this. 
Which one should we take? This, this? You want to try? Just one. No, we'll just get one. No, we'll eat it now. We'll eat it now. We'll eat it now. I'm full, but we'll eat it. I'm okay. I'll have some. Oh, it's fresh. It's hot and it's um. Oh, it's crispy. But where where is nicer to live? Like where are you happier, Naga or Manila? Naga, Naga. Yeah. We like Naga. It's relaxed. Let's meet someone here. Ah, okay. It's chilled out though. It's less busy. Not not as many people traffic. Fresh air. Fresh air. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Yeah. We like it here. So should we try these? Quick, quick. I say quick, quick. Like plural. We just got this one Giant. massive one. It's like we have good sauce, spicy. Good sauce, spicy sauce. Okay, let's go for the spicy. Oh, sweet vinegar. What's this? Vinegar. Cucumber. Oh, it's like it's like a. Oh, I forgot they call it in other countries. Take a look in here. It's like cucumber in like a sort of liquid. We'll just go for the spicy though. Yeah. Let's go for the spicy. This is super fresh, like it's um let's get it in the sun. It's um it's not like the soft bar, it's crispy like fried. Oh it's the cucumber oh. top up. Cucumber top up. <laughs> right, we'll try the the spicy, yeah? Yeah, the yeah. spicy. Try this. Oh that smells like I feel like shrimp paste. Now let's get a stick. Massive, eh? And it's really fresh, it's hot. This is probably gonna burn my mouth, isn't it? Oh. Oh, the I didn't even get to the egg. <laughs> oh, oh it's like a giant what's it? <laughs> is that what it tastes like? No. It tastes like the the batter they use, I don't know what they can taste the egg, don't I? Egg to that. It's glowing that in the sun. I've never seen one with this much batter on the outside though. Did you say this is Naga style? Yeah, they call it a different name. Oh, the egg. Oh. Not bad, but at all. I'm full, but. <laughs> but. Oh! Ooh. <laughs> Not so bad. That's good. Tagalog, yeah. Tagalog, yeah. You speak Tagalog, do you speak Pico? You speak Pico also? Yeah, in English, yeah. Three languages. Skilled man. Mandarin. Mandarin as well? Because I work there. Ah. Oh, you speak four languages. She, she. She, she. Meow, meow. I don't know what he said. So this quick quick is completely different than the ones we had before. The batter is super thick, almost like a cake. Yeah, completely different. And you can see I've made a right mess of it, but yeah. 20 pesos. It's quite a big snack that. You know that. It's not a little, it looks like a little snack, but it's not. Which is the best seller? The most popular is mango, yeah. Mango's the best. Right. Magic water as well. Magic water and mango. Ah, oh, these are the best. I couldn't help myself, it's too hot and they're too good. They're really good when you're thirsty. Is it 10 pesos? Okay, thank you. Okay, thank you so much, Salamapo. Thank you. Yeah, I couldn't help but get another and I've got the mango. It's also alright, it tastes like ice cream though, it tastes a bit strange though. A huge piece of jelly, or is it? Is it like mango jelly? We'll find out when I get to the shed. I've just got one thing to say though, which really annoys me. Everyone's getting snacks from there. And then instead of putting the snacks in one of the bins, which are all over this plaza by the way, there's loads of bins. People just like throw all their stuff on the floor or like just, just leave it where they're sat. Like, come on, look after your country. And I'm going to call them out. Someone needs to call people out who do supply. It's just laziness. Like, have some respect for your own country. Here's what it is. So, yeah, like, what's in here? And they just mango jelly. You can see big pieces in there, yeah. It's all right. It's ice cold. It's all that matters. Right, so this is Plaza Rizal. 
in the centre of Naga City. And it's really cool to be it's just a nice space again where you can sit under the trees, you know, in the shade, out of the sun. There's people selling the snacks, drinks. We've got our, what is that, like an Isle of Naga City down there? I knew it's alright to be It's alright. A lot of begging kids though. Which just seems to be a very like big thing in the Philippines, which obviously isn't great, but what can we do? We found some puppies for sale in the street. We've got a chow chow. The Pomeranian's cute though. This is Poodle. Hello, hello, hello. Oh, they, they are for sale? Oh, how much is the Pomeranian? 12,000. 12,000 for the Pomeranian? Yes, 12,000. What about the chow chow? 10,000. 10,000. The chow chow is 10,000. Oh, it's a little lady. Oh, she's a little girl. Oh, good boy. Oh, she's so kind. She's really cute, actually, isn't she? Look, she's cute. She's cute. 12,000. Can you say hello to the doggies? Oh. Oh. Yes, we keep seeing people who are selling dogs in the street, and they're always little cute puppies. Oh. Okay. Just by the riverfront here. Okay, thank you. Salam Bye bye. Oh, that, the Pomeranian is so cute. Oh. I think the poodle's cute too. Oh, she's got a cute little nose. A little nibbler. Oh. Needs to be careful, otherwise, at least she's going to end up buying one of these dogs one day. We need to keep our eyes on it. <laughs> What's she doing? <laughs> Which one would you get? Definitely Pomeranian. Pomeranian? She's a character, yeah. She was nibbling on my fingers. <laughs> the poodle was also so cute. So they're 12,000, which is 200 pounds? No. Yeah. Just under 200 pounds. Maybe like. 148 quid. Is it? Not a bad price for Pomeranian. Usually they're like 1,000 pounds in England. I mean, you don't know what you're getting on the street. It could be. Could it? Could be like a mix or it could be have worms or babies and it's been nibbling look at this one here we've got the um good shepherd jeepney go out get, oh we can look inside we've got the cross hanging oh it's wood inside we've got wooden seats look at this oh how cool is that yeah so we're gonna head back to our little local area here in Naga City. Really good little intro to here to Bicol. It's just so hot, so we need to get out of the sun. I don't know what we'll do for the rest of the day. Maybe we'll leave it there, maybe not, but either way, all I've got to say is a really good first impression. Everyone's been super nice, really smiley. Everyone's had time for us. It's just been, it's been really pleasant, honestly. It's a really nice place. It's so much more chilled out, so much nicer. Uh, there you go. Whatever, aircon dripping on my head. That's all that happens to me in the Philippines. Should we see if you want that way? Oh, he's full. Maybe we'll grab a tricycle back just for fun, eh? Why not? So we'll see if this guy will take us. We're literally going round the corner, like, oh, everyone's busy. Hi. When you don't need a tricycle, every single one stops and like mithers you and just like pesters you. But then when you actually want to get him one, no it's an impossible it. job, yeah. Maybe we need to knock on this person's house and ask if it'll take us in this piece. Look at this one. Wow, that is a... Um, that is interesting. It's like a box. Nice local shops. This is what they're all like here. In the provinces. Oh, you look cute. I'm not going to come near though, you'll bark. Mostly just getting a drink, cold. getting a cold drink. What does she have? Do we have cold drinks here? Yeah. I think so, yeah. Maybe. Do you have anything cold? Yeah. Water, water or... Oh, you have soft drinks. 
have Gatorade? Gatorade? Yeah, I'll have a Gatorade, please. Uh, 37. Okay. How many? How, how, how many? Just one, please. I'm hoping she's going to the fridge. <laughs> I'm not pissed as well and not giving us one of these ones. <laughs> Get her at 37, it's good, it's American, isn't it? It's more expensive than everything else. For a little one, yeah. Oh, perfect. Thank you. Cold Jack. We never drink beer around, oh. so it's a treat. Cold Jack, yeah. It's not bad, Get Red's, but it makes you feel hydrated. Thank you, ma'am. Have a good day. Salamat. Bye. Bye. They're all really nice, aren't they? They're just like people's houses. Like, yeah, this is just a house and she just decked a little shop into it. Lovely lady, yeah? Every, everyone in this neighbourhood where we're staying is lovely, absolutely lovely. Like, this is the nicest part. Oh, it's sweet! It's so sweet. I don't remember getting her a tasting sweet, but... Maybe it's the sugar addition instead of the... <laughs> it's refreshing. Chat. Are you busy? Where? Wait, you go to San Sebastian Street? Where? San Sebastian. San Sebastian? Yeah, Joe Mackill apart Apartel. Joe Mackill. What the street? San Sebastian. What the street? San Sebastian. Do you, know the, do you know the place? Yes, yeah, see? Yeah. It is, okay. Uh, how much is it? Eight? Uh -huh. Ocho? Eight pesos? Eight pesos? No, no, no. No, how much? Uh, what is the price? Huh? What? How much is? How many pesos? Eight? How much is it? Fifteen. About to Fifteen. It's fifteen. 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 San Sebastian Street. San Sebastian Street. Down here, you know? Yes. Yeah, so. How much? How many pesos? Thirteen pesos each. Thirteen. Okay. Oh. Let's get it. Why not? Thirteen. 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 One three. Okay. Oh, I, I like your hair. <laughs> your hair, very cool. Oh, yeah. Ah. Lots of flaps. So we don't Ooh. need to get this one, so we could just walk for five minutes, but we just wanted to get a tricycle. It's gone. Look at all them rides have got there. Oh, it's there. Oh, these legal things. Yeah, it's all hand-painted. Regular 38. Why do you all say regular 38? I don't know, is that? Oh, maybe that's old. <laughs> anyway. What we're doing a pick up of these as well. Picking some more passengers up on the way. Oh, you can get. How many can you get in there? I One, two. two I reckon two. three, four. On the back. Maybe on the back we can get one. Maybe we can get one or two on here as well. Yeah, I reckon we can get about eight people on here. If you really try. I mean, knows where we're going. Oh, yeah, we are now. <laughs> we could do a. Uh, Side car tour of Naga City, couldn't we? On this, look at the beautiful streets. Oh, oh no, this isn't it. This is the next one, isn't it? Oh, we're running him over. <laughs> we asked for directions and he told us the wrong street. <laughs> Now, now we're on the way to San Sebastian Street. It's just this building, isn't it? You see this this big building? It is here. Oh, I'm telling in the wrong directions. I don't, I don't know where we're going. This is a big building. We're just going past the street. We're just going past? Yeah. Oh, here is fine. Here is okay. I don't even know where we're going myself. So 26. Oh, let, me, let me get the change. We're going to have to cop her up. Is that enough? Yeah. Okay. Check, check it, right? Oh, yeah. Yeah? Perfect. Oh, yes, a little money box. What's this? Let me see in here. Oh, it's a change box. Yeah. Ah, okay. Salam Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, there we go. That'll be the end of today's Naga City Chronicle. Beautiful little tricycle, that, isn't it? Look at that. Off into the wind. Look at this. You've got a little chapel, Our Lady of Perpetual Help. But what I'm here to show you is this. The Wi-Fi box, piece of Wi-Fi. Now you see these everywhere. Little hand-painted sign, Wi-Fi box. So you have to find it, and you put your coins in for like what, what, like half an hour, an hour of Wi-Fi, whatever. 
And then yeah, you connect and it's um, just proper old school, isn't it? I've not seen this in any other country apart from here in the Philippines. Maybe I've seen it in Cuba about you 10 years ago. Hello sir, how are you? What's this, another shop? Oh yeah. Yeah, you don't see the don't see a Wi-Fi box off and deal like that. I think it might be like maybe like ten pesos for an hour or something, five pesos for an hour. It's very cheap. We've just spotted a sign that says hello hello for twenty pesos. Now we're gonna investigate and see if she's actually got any. It's just like this tiny little shop. Look, hello hello, twenty pesos. We also sell fried chip. Well, hello, you have hello hello? You have hello, hello? hello, hello. Yeah. You have? Oh, okay. 20 pesos. 20 pesos? Please can we have one? Uh, please can we have one? Grace! Let's see, let's see what let's see what we get. I have no idea what we're gonna get here. They've got cocks in that garden, huh? They've got cocks in the back. Oh god, it's all going on in the back there, isn't it? It's all going on. Hello. Let's see. I'll tell you what the lady's lovely when we arrived we said we said hello. As for hello, she just went, what? <laughs> But the, the younger one's actually really nice, so we'll, we'll let them off. No, I don't know what's going to be in here. It's come from the back. Yeah. With the cocks. There's all the cocks in the back in there. So it actually looks the same as the ones we've had everywhere else. Yeah, they're just for 20 pesos. Okay. Salam. Doesn't look too bad, does it? Looks all right. Might have a bit of a change crisis though. Okay, salam up. There we go. We've got our halo halo for 20 pesos. Doesn't look too bad. Looks alright, what's in there though? Some mystery goods, mystery goods. That have come from, I don't know where, because um, it got made in the um, rooster's home in the back. It smells alright. Do you want to give it a go, Lee? Do you want to be the crash dummy? Oh, but I, all I saw was condensed milk and there's obviously the ube in the bottom, ube ice cream. Let's get a bit of bio. Mmm. You know what? It just tastes like condensed milk. Oh, oh it's like ube like pudding. Ooh, let me try that. Ooh. Lots of sugar. Really sweet? Mm. Like I saw like tablespoons of sugar. Let's try it. I mean, I'm not, I wasn't expecting much, so... I'm just throwing it all over my feet. It's not bad. It's alright, isn't it? 20 pesos, what do you expect, really? 20 pesos, you... Well, you can't complain, can you? We can't. You're not allowed. It's very sweet. Very sweet, yeah. It's like I can't car eat it. The wind is just making me like... So you've also got like some... Oh, there's also jelly in there as well. jelly, maybe. What's this? Yeah. Is it flan or is it banana or jackfruit? It's like jackfruit. Oh, it's jackfruit. Mm. Oh. Jackfruit's good to be fair. Probably jelly. Huh. It's okay. It's okay, what can I say? Honest review of the 20 pesos, hello, <laughs> hello. Good evening, sir. How much to a plaza result? 26. 26, okay, okay. Here we go, here's the ride. Okay, thank you, Salaman. Oh, we were gonna get the jeepney, but... It's just easier. To be honest, I think it's about the same price to get the trike. So, we are heading to Plaza Rizal here in Naga City, Bicol. And the sun is about to set, so I think there should be lots of nice little street food, shops. I don't know what. We're gonna check it out, we're gonna see. All right, try it, it's in it. So that's the plan, it's 13 pesos each and it's only like, what, a five minute drive down the road. I think the standard fee is 13 pesos, like anywhere in the city. Maybe, maybe, yeah. Because yeah. we got one earlier and it was 13 yeah. pesos, yeah. Which is all, I think it's cool. We're, we're picking other people up now. Ah, but okay. So I think it's only in. like, I think that's like 14 p. So where's she getting in? She's getting on the back. She's getting on the back? Oh, she's getting on the back of the bike, ah. So yeah, you can get in here or you can just like side straddle the bike. Like our ladies done here with a Chanel bag, look at that. They're <laughs> authentic Chanel. Oh, 
mean, it's a good and fun way to travel here in the Philippines. I mean, you can't go wrong when you look at this church. So we're just heading down here. Oh, look at this, look at the views. I don't know what this river's called that runs through Naga City, but yeah, look at that. Golden hour, best time of the day. Okay, Salamanco. Here we are, we've arrived. There we go. Oh. Thank you, sir. Oh. Look at our tricycle. We picked the one with the most character, the one that was the most beat up. There she is. Good night. So we're here and the sun hasn't set yet. There's not much around though, is there? Oh, after I was, you know, I was thinking there's going to be a lot of street food. It's Saturday night and all we've seen is far on the way in is Balu. But we'll look anyway. We'll see, we'll see what's going on. So this is Plaza Rizal. Maybe it sets a little bit later. A bit later, yeah. Because yeah. the sun hasn't gone down yet. So this is like the nice plaza area here in <laughs> Naga City. And it's fairly busy to be honest. We came here in the day and it wasn't this busy. There's so many people here now. Obviously now the sun's gone down, it's a lot cooler. But I'll tell you what is here, there's shops here selling like wrist, um, what do you call them, bracelets and like anklets and stuff. At least she's looking at. Yeah. You make them? Yeah. You make ah. them. What are these? Well, like this. What's that? I don't even know what that is, that little bar. 70 pesos. 70 pesos? Yeah. They're cute, aren't they? I feel alright, yeah. And he makes them. He knocks the... Um, you make them all at home? Oh, you have this one. What stone are they? Jeep stone. They're cute. Maybe I will get this one. Let's see. A little green and gold number. So at least she's grabbing this. First thing off the bat. What is it? An ankle? Yeah, a little ankle bracelet. And they are 70 pesos. Bracelets for you. Leaker Arts and Crafts. Oh, mate, here, make some. He tells us. There we go. And now we'll take a look at what street food's knocking around. There is some stuff over there. We've seen some stuff. So we're going to go and head over there and check it out. But at the minute, it's just like mostly just jeepneys and tricycles everywhere. We'll see, we'll see. So around the plaza is where all the jeepneys seem to park and they're all so cool. Why are jeepney drivers legends in the Philippines? It must be like a requirement to be a jeepney driver. You have to be a, just a full-time legend. Look at how cool they are. I don't think I'm gonna get sick of them in our entire time here because they're all so cool. Right, so we've come to this spot which is outside the People's Market, the People's Mall here in Naga City and then Saturday night it's turned into like a massive used clothes fest. And what's happened here is our mayor has just opened a huge bag of hats and everyone's dived in. You know, to try and find like branded stuff. And it tells us everything here has come from Japan. What's this leash? This is like, it's called United Colors of Benton. I've seen this in like England. People selling this in England. I think it's like a good quality yeah, yeah, bucket, it is, doesn't it? It's a good quality brand. I want to see you try this one on. Oh, I've had it swiped off me, the orange one. Nice, illuminous orange hat. So look, everyone's just like rooting through, look. 150 bucks. 50 pesos, 50 pesos each. It's a proper business here, look. I'm guessing that these come like new in every day, maybe. You get new ones with, with the heifer, with the box. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So every day do you get more? Hmm? Every day do you get more? Uh, sometimes. sometimes. Sometimes, sometimes. Not every day. Not every day. Well, yeah, look at the this sea of hats. This one matches your top. <laughs> well, okay, try this one on. Try it on. <laughs> oh, yeah. Oh, hey. <laughs> Beautiful. Maganda. Maganda. <laughs> they were saying he looks like a construction worker or something. Yes, yeah, so I mean, if you need some used clothes, like you want some new clothes, this is where you want to be coming. Let's see. Oh, it looks alright, that. Let's give us a spin. 
It looks all right. That you, you need one of these to get sun off your eyes as Usually, well. Usually, because I've got such a big head, it's like sat on top like this. It actually fits. I think for 50 pesos, you can't go wrong with that. And it's yeah, I know. well, it's dogs. So it's going to attract the sun, but we need this for the island, don't we? Oh, that that one's a no go. <laughs> You're like a granny. That one's terrible. That one's terrible. Where's the orange one? There's a bright orange one in here. I try and find it. This one. Where is it? This one. Get that one on you. Oh, no, let's get it on anyway. <laughs> it's a hit, this. This is well busy. There's so many people. Everyone knows you snipe your bargains here, don't you? You've got to come early. When everyone's putting their stuff out, you've got to grab it whilst it's hot. This is like my paradise because back in England, I used to love going to like charity shops and kilo sales and just grabbing your bargains early. Oh, you won't look at the There's two bosses. You and him. Well, where is Mr. Playboy? Mr. Playboy, where is it? Oh, he's shopping. Oh. shopping. Boss man's busy shopping, not yeah. bloody tending his stall. Yeah. We've, 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 we've ushered him over. We're going to get this one. This one. 50 pesos. Deal. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Not bad at all. Where's the McDonald's hat? Where's the McDonald's hat gone? The, the no, McDonald's, McDonald's one, the no, Mackey's one. McDonald's <laughs> one bought it. Ah, see, I don't know, I don't Someone's bought the Mackey's one. Someone's bought it. They got a, they got a Mackey's hat. <laughs> Actual Mackey's. They've got a Mackey's hat imported from Japan. Oh, I've got, have I got the old shop looking for the Mackey's hat now? Oh, here. Ah, so look, we've got the Mackey's hat. That's the grail. Real drip chicken. The Real drip. Yes. <laughs> oh, leash. Very, very throw, throw this one in. <laughs> very what? Maporma. It's like Maporma drippy. Drippy. What is it? Is it looking good? Yes. yes. Yeah, it good. <laughs> the Mackey's hat. Where it is. Maporma, Maporma. It's on the left. <laughs> Mackey's drip. <laughs> It's funny these lads, everyone's a right jokes there. You think it's a jelly bean? You can actually get some good stuff though if you want. Uh, if you come early and look. This is his hat. I, my, I will keep mine, I'll keep mine. You love that man. <laughs> yeah. Alright, have a nice night lads. Thank you. Cheers. Bye bye. Everyone's really lovely here. Yeah? So I'm just going to quickly show you. Should we go down this way? I'm just going to quickly show you like the scale of this market, just how much stuff there is. Look, just like rolls and rolls and rolls of pants, like proper good quality pants, jeans and pants. Then there's like t-shirt racks as well. Like, well I wonder where they're from, they're probably just from different countries all over the world aren't they, but like... <laughs> proper t-shirts. I mean, uh, not that one, that one's like a American religious school, but yeah, I think so. You've just got to get lucky. So like, if you've, if you've got the time to like, just come and sift through, you can get the proper bargain. Like, some stuff is like 15 pesos, I'm not even joking. Like, look at the scale around here. It's massive. It's all going on. The bargains you can find <laughs> at the night clothes market. Look at this. England top. 100% genuine, look at that. Someone buy this, you need to buy this someone, buy this someone in the market. Classic. But you get the picture, we've got shorts, tops, jeans. Look at this, jeans, and I bet they're all really affordable. Like the hat was 50 pesos, which is about 75p or something. You've got everything here, there's even like thick jackets. Not that you would want a thick jacket. Not that I would want a thick jacket at this time of year anyway, but they've got it all. Just next to this um, statue, outside the market. It's really busy here, there's so many jeepneys flying by and um, yeah, it's a bit busy area. Like, I know this isn't for us and we're obviously not going to be wearing these, but look at this for a deal. 10 pesos for kids shorts, 50 pesos for normal shorts. What else have we got? It's like the jeans are like 100 pesos, which is still really, really good, isn't it? Right, we just grabbed some food and I've just got to show you this. This is called chicken pastil with rice. It's like cold chicken and then I've covered it in that chili sauce and it's not even a sauce, is it? It was like chili oil. But let's be serious, that's just like pure fiery hot chilies. 
I mean, we are in Bicol. Now, the sad thing is, I have to eat this with a glove. I can't believe my life is always this, because there's nowhere to wash your hands here, obviously, and everyone's doing it, because you just can't wash your hands, so. Let's try it. We've got two rices. How much are this again? I think it's 22 each, yeah. So, it looks really good to be fair. It's just like cold chicken and rice. Messy one, isn't it? I, I don't like this eating me gluffins. I can't, because I got my fingertips are touching the food. I can't, it feels wrong, like I don't know where the food is. Oh, it feels wrong. Oh, yeah. That? It's delicious. That is so hot. It's like, it's pure chilli. It's actually quite good. It does taste a little bit coconut. -y. It's quite tasty, that, you know. Yeah. I think yeah. Maybe they put the chicken in like coconut oil or something. I don't know, but it does have like a coconut taste to it, doesn't it? Yeah. It's really good. I don't know what's going on behind. It's like, I think they're like telling the life story or something. I'm not sure. I don't know, it's a bit loud, isn't it? It's all going on. I like my salt. Oh, it's like sitting at the bottom, just like <laughs> half chili, half rice. Not bad, that. It's delicious. 